This is Kit St. John's Wort Smythe of Godaming in Surrey, an expert gamer. Gamers, who are they and what drives them? My name's Tyler. Tyler. So Tyler, do you play a lot of video games? I do. What kind of games do you like? Uh, mostly RPG. A lot of it is just, I can do something that's brainless, that's not, you know, like I get to leave work behind, I get to leave business behind, all of that, and just kind of zone out, you know, whereas something like, and that's why I don't like first person shooters as much, is because it's still, my brain's not occupied, I'm like, oh, I can point and click and shoot at people, but there's not that in-depth experience of like, character relation and, uh, you know, some of the ongoing jokes and role-playing games, you know, not NPCs, non-player characters have turned into their own jokes to the internet. Um, and, and I don't get a lot of that out of other games. The relationships that exist online are, are different than the relationships, you know, that I have with other people because it's, you know, you're having, you're, in, you're interacting with someone that doesn't have a face and you don't know their real name, you know, you start calling them by their screen names or nicknames of their screen names and, and that's kind of the persona that you get to know of people and, and really you can relate, you know, even with myself, like I can build a different persona out of my name and people know me by that persona and not who I really am. The gaming phenomenon is now so well established as a central component of mass culture that subcultures have begun forming. The Yost cast is one of those subcultures that seek to divert attention away from school back to what it's really all about, having fun. Recently, four students from the prestigious Portland State University delved into the online gaming community called Yost cast. Yes, I have heard of the Yacht Test. How did you uh, find out about him? Uh, I heard it from my friend. He basically, uh, we were both interested in Guild Wars 2 and then they had some videos from it, so he linked it to me. I have heard of the Yacht Test. How did you hear about him? Um, probably just through random YouTube links. So what's your favorite thing about the Yacht Test? Probably their British accents. They're, they're absolutely hilarious, the way they sound and the way they talk. I guess they have early access to uh, video games and beta, so that's mainly why I like them. And uh, do you feel like it contributes to your gaming knowledge? <laughs> <laughs> um, not really, no. no. It's, it's just for pure entertainment. Simon Lane and Lewis Brindley founded the Yogs cast when they noticed that gamers had nothing to watch during tea time in England. At first, Yachtscast covered World of Warcraft, but expanded to cover many other popular games such as Minecraft. Fans of the Yachtscast call themselves the Yachtnauts and have created their own online community. And much like any fan culture, participants' identities become intimately linked to the series or the characters. I'd like a new video, please. I know you're busy, but hear me out, guys. I have no social life. Many Yogs Noughts discovered Yogs Serve through YouTube links, but others have more amusing stories. Core, a Yog Nought reminisces. Believe it or not, when I first found out about Yogscast, I was searching for yogurt on YouTube and found you guys. The Yognauts demographic is in contrast to the gaming community at large. 50-50 male and female logging in from around the globe, connecting to their peers only through wired connections. The Yognauts group norms established by the forum rules have allowed this unique, dynamic and pervasive culture to exist. For example, using sexist, racist, homophobic or hateful language results in being banned from the community. So things like tiny sex and flaming 
are non-existent in this environment. This bodes well for female gamers. Typically, gaming sites are predominantly male and women are not portrayed in the most equalizing fashion. These delightfully unusual characteristics have created an ethnocentric vibe to the community. For example, access to this cyber culture is dictated by the level of involvement in the community. For private messaging to be unlocked, a member must have a certain number of posts. One artifact of the Yognos is the delectable Jaffa Cakes. This English tea time treat is a sponge cake with creamy orange jelly filling covered in a crisp dark chocolate. Merlin, a popular Yogno member, is so enamored with Jaffa Cakes that he is on a personal quest to find the perfect Jaffa Cake. He gives online Jaffa Cakes in post to other users. Yozcast, a cyberculture. Why does it matter? The Yogcast cyberculture matters because it gives a voice to those who might not normally express it online. They created a welcoming space for games, particularly for new gamers and female gamers. One woman who frequently listens to Yozcast learnt English from their message boards. Another fan learnt HTML coding from it. He never would have had the nerve to ask other groups, but has found the Yogcast community to be very accepting. In addition to the Yognot's unusual demographics, cyber capitalism is not an issue, much like other gaming communities such as World of Warcraft or the Old Republic. This is because the podcast and fan site are completely free to access. Yoskas is important because of the sense of community it provides on a global scale. People can come together, drink tea, share Jaffa cake and game while physically existing in different areas of the world. Common interests and cyber technology makes it all possible. I mean, there's, there's a certain security in the fact that people aren't ever going to know, you know who I really am. It's, I can be kind of whoever I want. Simon and Lewis are coming out with their very own video game called Yog Ventures, thanks to a very successful Kickstarter project. One more important detail one must know if they wish to become an elite Yognaut is that of their salute. But don't worry, just like all cultural elements, this can be learned. I am Dave! Yognaut and I have the balls! I am Dave! Yognot and I have the balls! I am Dave! Yognot and I have the balls! I'm Dave and I have the balls. <laughs> <laughs>